Hello everybody and welcome to our short clips with Change with Art, helping people to develop creatively through art classes, creative activities. This short clip today we are going to talk about the importance of children playing. This is also great information for you as an adult to understand where you have forgotten to play. As children, they express and feel everything completely at an intense level. As adults, we've been taught by society, framed, put in boxes, shown what is acceptable and not acceptable. With that comes a lot of baggage from our past, from how we see things, how we communicate, how we love, to even how we speak about our feelings and deal with grief and bereavement. When you were a child, you were basically teaching your people who you grew up with how to relax, how to see the lighter side of life. And that's why children are here in our lives. As adults, when we have problems, we all see a counsellor, we may see a therapist, we may speak to a friend. Whatever that is, we know how to communicate and say how we feel. Children don't. When your child is going through emotions, whatever situation is happening, they need to be able to play with their toys. Playing with their toys is a form of counselling, it's a form of healing, it's a form of relaxation. It helps them to actually break down what has just happened around them, depending how stressful the situation is. If you find you are having disagreements, arguments with your children, which is natural, it's very important to allow them to have their personal space first before you sort out the argument. So for instance, if they choose to go to their room, make sure they have accessibility to their toys. That way, what they're doing is they start playing what's just happened in their brain and they actually play it out through their toys. Their toys become their counsellor or their therapist. They then role play through situations or they may work out frustrations. Whatever they do, give them that time and space to cool off just as much as you need that time. Once everybody is calm, you can then obviously discuss what has happened and you can work to heal that or solve that. With children, playing, having access to play, especially every day, is so important because not only does it help them process their emotions, when they need to think through situations, but it teaches them strategies how to survive and how to handle life skills when they grow older. When you think about how children are stopping playing with toys, playing in general, playing outside, all there's so many different kinds of plays available to us. When we stop playing, we start stressing. Think about you now as an adult. When you are stressed at work and you eventually get to step away from your work and do something that is worth playing, so whether it is going out with the friends, laughing, giggling, going away on holidays, doing activities together, it's all activities that involve a bit of play, whether you're playing hide and seek with your friends or playing games, obviously adults would do some with their drinking games, it's still a game at the end of the day. Playing games gives you the time to step away from life, to relax, to unwind. And children are here to remind us just how important play is. We always are very quick to think that we need to finish work, we need to get things done. But if you give yourself time to have a little bit of play, if not every day, at least once a week on the weekend, for you as an adult, then you start to actually relax and come up with better solutions. That's why it's very important to ensure your children constantly play as much as possible, even throughout their schooling, even from when they are teenagers. Play is so important. It will teach them to have a breather from their problems, situations or troubles. Hope you've enjoyed this clip. If you'd like any more information, you're more than welcome to visit us at changewithart.com or you can book a session and we can help you further.